Hi everyone, Dr. Victoria Scrubo here, speaking to you from the Caesar Transformation Healing Center in Wareham, Massachusetts. I want to do a quick read on Don McGann. Um, there was a uh, something that came down from the court saying that uh, he must, um, if Congress wants to talk to him, he must respect or go by the subpoena um, that, oh, excuse me, I'm just going to shuffle over here. Um, that um, we, we don't have a king, we have a, a president that needs to uh, listen to the will uh, of, or of the other parts of, of the government. So um, let's see what what's happening with this. So there is a stay now, but let's see uh, what the future looks like for this. McGann's testimony. All right, people. The Ace of Fire. Oops, can you see that? Oh, dear. Sorry, guys. Uh, I'll find the sweet spot. Here it is. Here it is. The One of Fire. Um, so this is... Um, this is a very powerful card. Um, there's a lot of energy here. There's a sort of an ending and a beginning. So um, ending in that, the vibration of this card is a 27-9. Beginning in that's an ace. Um, so that's so that's pretty uh, pretty powerful. Let's see what's crossing it. Um, we have the nine of wind. This is great anxiety. So somebody has great anxiety over this. I would guess it's Trump, but maybe even McGann has some uh, anxiety over this. Maybe he can be held responsible for something. Hmm. Let's see what's in the pan. Uh, what's in the? What's at the root of this? Four of water. Um. In this deck, the four of water is sort of like an overwhelm, like emotional overwhelm. Um overflowing an overflowing of emotion see what's in the past the chariot could be victory victory in the past that he got away with it up to this point let's see what's in the sky uh, the moon so emotions are very very high instability a little bit of lunacy yeah, this this is really rocking. Uh, I think rocking the president's world. Immediate future. Immediate future. Uh, nine of fire. This is the eye in the sky, as I like to call this card. Um, and what do they call this card in this deck? Oh, the eye of fire. So this is perspective. This is perspective. So in so the future is perspective. This future is we're going to see what ha actually happened. He's not going to be able to to hold this back. He might be able to hold the taxes back if uh, he leaves. If he if they make him an offer, he can't refuse. But uh, this is coming out. How it's seen from the outside, the emperor. The exposure of the emperor. Exposure of of Trump. No, domestic situation. Glory. Um, this is um, the six of of um, of wands. This is a this is kind of a victory card or a glory card, but glory with, at what price kind of thing. Um, that could very well be him winning, and why he won or how he won. Uh, we might actually see more information on uh, his connection to Russia, and um, and how they they did aid him. Um, in ways to win the election. Hopes and fears. Hmm. The star. Oh, reversed. The star was reversed. I don't usually do reversed cards in this deck. Um, the, 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 the star reverses a loss of hope. So I think that's a fear loss of hope and the outcome 
the Eight of Winds. This is called Power Shield. This is, um, in the other decks, it's the woman on the beach with all the swords around her. Um, in this deck, it's a little bit different. Um, this is utilizing uh, spin. We can see that there's um, a, uh, <laughs> a tornado up here. Utilizing spin in the mind. Um, they're going to try their best to spin this and lie about it and all that stuff. But I think they, it still comes out. Let's see if we can get a major arcana. We have the four of wands, the four of swords. So that's retreat. The two of swords. And the last card, the sun. So the sun is going to come out. The, things are going to be exposed, definitely going to be exposed, no matter how hard they try to uh, dissuade and obfuscate and make another story about it. So it definitely looks like we're going to find out a lot more uh, about uh, what happened at the, at the beginning there with McGann and stuff. So that's good news. All right, I hope you enjoyed that. Like and subscribe, and I'll see you again soon. Take care. Oh, have a great Thanksgiving for those Americans who are doing Thanksgiving. Okay, bye.